Number seven, Jose is going to paint the four lateral walls of his barn below. He will not paint the roof or floor, nor the windows and door. How much surface area of paint will he need? Well, it tells me that I'm going to uh, paint the lateral walls. I'm not, I'm not even concerned with finding uh, the, la the surface area of the triangular prism, just the rectangular prism um, on the bottom. And again, I'm not going to find the surface area of the floor or ceiling. So again, this is just lateral surface area. So the formula for lateral surface area of a prism is S equals pH. So that's the perimeter of my base times the height of my prism. So LSA stands for lateral surface area of your rectangular prism. So S equals P times H. So here um, we first have to establish the base of my rectangular prism. And remember on a rectangular prism, the bottom is always your base, which means that this rectangle is my base. So since I'm finding the perimeter of this, I want to find the distance going all the way around it. So to find the perimeter, that means I'm going to add 15 plus 20 plus 15 plus 20. So 15 plus 20 plus 15 plus 20, we get 70. So the perimeter was 70 times the height of my prism, which is the distance between my bases, is 18. So now 70 times 18 is 1,260. So the lateral surface area is 1,260 feet squared. But that is not the amount of paint that needs to be covered. Um, I'm not going to cover the door and I'm not going to cover the window. So I have to find the area of both of those. Um, I have to find the area of both the window and door and then subtract it from this total. So first, let's go ahead and find the door. The door is in the shape of a rectangle, so that means I can find the area of that door by doing length times width. Now, here, uh, the length of my door is um, 8, and the width is 7. So 8 times 7 is 56. Then we also have the window. And again, we can do this by doing length times width. And the length is 3, and the width is 2. 3 times 2 equals 6. So 56 plus 6 is 62. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the lateral surface area of my rectangular prism and I'm going to subtract 62 from it. So 1260 minus 62 the lateral surface area that needs to be painted is going to be 1,198 feet squared. So here my answer is 1,198 feet squared.